from a nine-year-old who got handcuffed after a violent tantrum. Ow, don't oh, you want to throw stuff though, right? Let me go! I'm not gonna do that. Ow! You're throwing things. You're putting everyone. Shut the up! up! You need to hear it. Ew. To a bunch of unruly teens who put a school into lockdown. This is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Do you know who I am? Probably not. Nope. Okay. Mm -hmm. When yes. did I yell? Where is the proof of me yelling at people? It's from multiple kids. Here are the times when school bullies realize they're going to jail. Starting with the spoiled brat who was taken down after refusing to follow orders. See, now you're testing me. Don't touch me. Well, come on outside and talk to me. And I won't have to lay a hand on you. you... Oh, now you want to touch me? Oh, hey. I'm not going to hurt you. Don't give me any. Now shut your mouth Why and relax. Why'd you throw it? I think we need to check for her maybe having too bad. That's what happens when you resist. Sit down. Ow. Sit down. Don't touch me like that. Ow. When an adult tells you to do something here at the school, you do it. Simple as that. On the 14th of April 2018, police were called after an unruly child caused a scene at her school. Little did she know that being cool in front of her friends would land her in handcuffs. Hello, what's going on? Well, I was told I'm going to be handcuffed. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, one, come on out here and talk to me for a second. Well, about what? I can talk to you right here. No, no, no. Come on out here and talk to me. Yeah, so we can, we can discuss what's going on. No, no, no. Right out here. Oh, she's not even dressed properly. Yeah, she has to go to Miss Kipper's class. I'm not dressed Here, come here. All right. Yeah. See, now you're testing me. Don't touch me. Well, come on outside and talk to me, and I won't have to lay a hand on you. You, you got it? You, you're on video right now, and right now you're disrupting everything that's going on right now. Do you hear me? Yeah. So here's the okay. thing. Okay. I'm, I'm finished my online class, mm -hmm. and I'm sitting here at lunch. Okay. And then my teacher's telling me that, oh, you can't make it. She's not making a disturbance. Oh, she is now. So, hey, don't get, a, don't get involved in this. Let me and her deal with it, okay? I don't want you to get in any trouble. Okay, but I'm already getting in trouble, so why do I just enjoy my time? No, you can't do that. Because they're not because right now you're creating a disruption. You've got him here. We got her here. Okay. Despite having a cop with them, the kids were supportive of the suspect. She probably should have thought of the consequences of her actions before acting so difficult. Come on out here. I love you, my friend. Oh. Stand up. No, Stand don't up. touch me. Stand up. Do not touch Stand me. Stand up. Don't touch everybody me. Everybody out. Get everybody out. No. Get these guys out of here. Go. Out. Go. Oh, now you want to touch me. I'm not going to hurt you. Hey. Don't give me your oh. Give me your hand. What the hell is going on with you guys? Huh? What is going on with you? Is this what I gotta do every day now? No! No, me! You're hurting me! I think you probably should have thought about that before you decided to be stupid. Roll over. Stand up. Let's go. Now shut your mouth Why'd and relax. Why'd you throw it? I think we need to check her maybe having a... She's acting very strange. Can you test her for... Yep. Let's go. That is. It's absolutely ridiculous. Too bad. Too bad. That's what happens when you resist. Sit down. Sit down. Don't touch me like that. Now that she was in his custody, she began to act like she did nothing wrong. Unfortunately, there was no going back. For resisting and also for obstruction as well as campus disruption. It wasn't disruption for you. Oh, no. Come on.
Don't do anything stupid. Oh, Alright, have a seat. <laughs> you wanna check that? <sighs> Trying to be helpful to you. But you had to go and do that. And this is where we're at. Well, guess what? You shouldn't have stood up and came at me. Because that's why you ended up on the ground. I got everything on video. You might not have realized what you were doing. You don't resist me. When I put my hands on you, it's for a reason. There ain't no reason for you to sit there and try to pull away and resist me. That's why you ended up on the ground. Well, you probably should have listened to what I had to say, and I was trying to be nice to you, but you didn't. Until then, the kids still didn't understand how grave her actions were. Think I like doing this stuff now? It seems like you've done it twice. Apparently, yeah, I've done it twice because people don't listen. For skipping. It's more than that. Do you not understand no, that? I don't understand that. Yeah, you've got a problem grasping your hand around that concept, oh. don't you? When an adult tells you to do something here at the school, you do it. Simple as that. This isn't a hard concept. <sighs> hey, is Yonkov coming up here? Uh, I don't know. Okay. Yeah, make sure she comes on up here because we need to do the discipline and uh, parental notification. In the end, the student was charged with resisting without violence and disruption of a school function. Moving on to the ignorant family who proved that bad parenting is the worst thing for a kid to experience. Get off my son! Get off my son! Let him go! I got him! These keep on pushing me around! On the 29th of November 2022, police responded to a fight at school. Two kids had a physical altercation earlier that day, which led to a bigger altercation when 10 family members arrived to defend one of the kids. What happened next was a tense situation. family members, the kid's mother stood out. She just had to be smart.
bro. Oh, I'm sitting down, man. Oh, you, you ain't sitting. Roll over. Roll over then. Roll into you. Stop pulling. Bro, I can't breathe. Stop yeah. pulling. Stop pulling. Bro, I'm not! I stopped the wrong time ago. I was No, we were taking it easy, honey, but you already heard. Whatever. Your mama cluster behind a dirty porty potty. Oh. Ma! Hey, bro. Hey. Y'all gonna make me feel Y'all gonna make me feel Oh, my mom. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. Trying to sit up. Okay, just settle down. Can you just get the off me, bro? God damn. Okay, but you're making it worse. Just settle down. No, don't sit on me. Yeah, I ain't playing with you yet. Bro, let me sit up. Then sit. You ain't not what I'm doing. No, you ain't doing that. You're fighting. They won't listen to cops at all. Fully escalating the situation. Trying to get my phone, honey. I ain't put my phone. You need to lay back. Give me my phone. Things took a darker turn when the mum continued to make the situation worse for her kid. Him. And then they went to go after him. Yeah. So, yeah, that's when we figured it out. When you're born, they tell us for the first 
At that point, their entire family was at the scene being disorderly. This was only the beginning of a crazy situation. They didn't even understand what was happening. They were just attacking the cops and the school personnel. This was a huge mistake. It's cool. You only going to week dash street. We'll be there to no, get you. He's not going to jail. He's not going to jail. Who, him? So right, why, why, why Puerto Rico talk about he going to jail? Nobody going to jail. Puerto Rico right here said my nephew going to jail. Puerto Rico said. He didn't come. We don't even have a Puerto Rico said he's where he came from. Can you just pull your car? Nobody. My car is right here. Move her car. family still went ballistic, even though the kid already got released from being detained. The cops feared the worst. They're not getting out until that red car's gone. Mom and I are in agreement. The red car's gone. They leave. Listen, listen, we're not going to do all that. I'm pulling out like they asked. I know, but this is, this isn't happening. Hey, this is what happened. Hey, you failed to leave the property. You're going to be arrested for criminal trespass. Are you refusing to leave the property? Get in the car. Get in the car. Okay, she's going to leave the car. Get in the car. Get in the car. Thank you. Get in the car.
about to leave when they started to confront the cops again. In the end, it was unclear if charges were pursued, but no one was arrested on scene of the altercation. If you thought that was crazy, wait until you hear about the three teens who put an elementary school in lockdown. I'm driving. I can't be doing that. Shit. Do you know who I am? Probably not. Nope. Okay. Mm -hmm. When did I yell? Where is the proof of me yelling at people? It's from multiple kids. On the 15th of March, 2023, police responded to an elementary school for a threats complaint. A black car had driven by and yelled profanities at the kids on a playground, threatening to harm them. This was only the beginning of a crazy situation. 58, uh, both front passenger, rear passenger are reaching towards the center. I don't know if they're buckling their belts or what. Can you hey, any music down, please? Can you roll your window down, please? Thank you. How you doing? Good to see your driver's license, please. For what? Complaint over at the school of threats being yelled out at the school kids. Good to see all your driver's license and IDs because it's a complaint from all of you. I don't have one. don't have one? No. Do you have your ID on you? Front passenger, I'm talking to you. Do you have your ID on you? Can you roll your window down and talk to that officer? I'm trying to turn the car off. What's your first name? One second, I'm not finished chewing Brady. And a birthday, Brady. Don't reach in your pockets, please. What's your address, Brady? I know. You don't know your address? No. Well, step out of the car for me. For what? Because I'm asking to step out of the car. Can I ask what kind of threats were made? Threats to the kids. That is not true at okay. all. Okay, well that's the complaint we've received. We're literally getting back from Madison. Here, on you. Sorry, poke stick us. What's your name, sir? Alex. Hey, Alex, I'm Ryan. Um, were you guys over by... Um, was it Blessed Sacrament. Sacrament a little bit ago? Uh, no, I don't think so. You don't think so? Do you know where it is? King and Losey, were you guys over there? Did you guys like have any interactions with the kid on the playground? Mm -hmm. None at all? Mm -hmm. Okay, I was just coming back from my friend's court date. Oh, okay. Over the courthouse? No, he had court up in Toma. Oh, okay. We were just coming back from there and then... Hunter, why don't you go ahead and step out of the car for me, please? Brady, just stay in the vehicle, okay? Step back this way. Stop right there. Anything on is no. gonna stick me. 
So you would have went by Blessed Sacrament there. I don't know if you knew that or not. Oh, like, I'm not saying that you had any is. reactions. I'm just saying that. That's that's where. Okay. Is. My strong suggestion is probably just change the attitude because it's no, not. No, this is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. We didn't do anything. Okay. Well, your attitude isn't going to help you. So we had a complaint. People in this car were yelling at the kids in the playground. That's why you're being stopped right now. Okay. Okay. Step over this way, please. He can, he can come right here. We'd like to hear your side if there was like someone saying something to you first or something like that. The cops had broken up the three suspects. They all gave different narratives, which made it seem like they didn't get their stories straight. I met you before. Oh yeah? I'm Sergeant Rossman. You recognize me? I don't think so. How do I know you? I don't know if I know you either. I was just asking oh. if I did. Yeah, I don't think so. Can you tell me what happened today over at school? Nothing. We came back from Madison. We're going there for a court day because our friend's going to prison. Okay. And we're driving back and we're here to go pick up a friend from school. Okay. And where did you pick him up from? We haven't picked him up yet. We're about to. He goes to TC. Was there information that there was a ski mask involved? I'm going to pull him out. Yeah, I'm going to step out for him again. What's your name? Are there any ski masks in the vehicle that you know of? There's possibly one in my backpack, but I haven't okay. had it on. So what caused you to go by the school over on Mosey? Because we're coming back from on Alaska. Do you want to just face the car and just put your hands up? I'm going to patch you for weapons at this point, okay? Okay, can I see it? I don't want to search your bag. I just want you to show it to me. I'll, ha I'll, I'll have him bring the bag here if that's right. We're coming this way. Okay, so what caused you to go all the way down and around and, and make a loop? Ma'am, I don't think you understand. We did not yell at any kids. Can you put your phone away, please? You can call make someone when, when we're done here, okay? okay? All right. You're not answering my question. If you're coming to pick up it's him... It's Am I going back to jail? I don't think so. It is relevant. We okay? did not make any to any children. Why okay. would we yell at a bunch of kids saying we're going to kill them? That's a good question. That's a very good question. One, one of two things happen. You're going to leave here no matter what, okay? You, you're either going to get nothing, and we'll see you later, or you're going to get probably a ticket, okay? Depending yeah. on the investigation. Like, I'm trying to stay Could you just, yeah, that's cool. You look like my dentist. That's why I recognize oh, you. I swear. Uh, definitely not oh, a dentist. I'm so, I'm trying to stay out of Did you yell out the window anything? No, I'm driving. Okay, did your passengers yell out the window anything? No. They yelled nothing. No. Did you drive down Losey? Did you drive down 24th? I don't know. We've been driving all day. We've Did you drive down? Hours. Well, you would probably, know. What, we probably have, yes. We've Did driven. you go about down 24th Street or Losey Boulevard? Yes. yes. But, but you know what I'm saying? If something was yelled, let's just get to that so we don't have to spend here for an hour while an investigation is conducted over there. We got the call today worried about uh, kids and kids' safety. You know what I'm saying? So if someone did it's yell something, just if someone did yell something, just just let's let's have out with it right now. I didn't yell anything. Did anybody in the car yell anything? Yes. What? I assume Which so. One? Which one? Losey for sure. Okay. Did you turn on to 24th Street? Where's that? Something happened. I wasn't there. We had other officers at school reviewing all the video. Tell me what happened, man. Hang tight with Officer Scray here. While the driver kept denying that they had threatened anyone, the other two suspects admitted that they did drive by. So if you're coming here to get him, what would cause you to go by the school? Well, first we're going to our friends Thomas, and then we went to Quitra to get okay. more gas, and then we came back and we're coming here. Where'd you stop for quick for gas at? Basically, the only thing that happened was we drove by and there was a bunch of kids playing football in the road. Yeah. And one kid threw the ball to him and he dropped it. And we said he's bad at football. That's all that happened. The kid said he's bad at football? No, we said he was bad. You at said football. the kid was we bad at football. We did not threaten no one or anything. Okay. That's literally all we said. You're bad at football. So you went one. you went way out on Mormon Cooley Road, got gas. And then we're coming back this way. Yeah, we, yeah, we're not going anywhere. We're not getting any cooperation either. So they did admit to um, one of them admitted that they did drive by there though. Did anybody yell anything out the windows that would made them think that somebody was yelling? They threats? did not yell any threats. We don't got time for that. Did did you yell out the window? No. They claim not to know where Blessed Sacrament was, but they gave me the route, so it would took them right there. So we do have them there, so. No. Mm -hmm. I'm driving. I can't be doing that shit. People can yell and still drive. So we went, turned around, and we went back the way we came. And they were all just around the teacher saying whatever they said. I don't know. Okay. Do you know who I am? Probably not. Nope. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I've been trying to stay out of shit for so long. Mm -hmm. I do not need this. Okay. Well. Here we are. 
I know, and I'm not trying to be here, and I'm not trying to be rude, but it's okay. frustrating. Yep, and you can get as frustrated as possible, but we have as much as you want, but we have a job to do. We received that, a complaint, and they had to take all these kids into the school because of the threats that were and made. And I'm not even mad at you guys. I'm just mad at whoever called the f***ing police saying that we're trying to school kill officials. kids. School officials. Well, whoever's saying we're making threats, saying we're trying to kill them is... And you made no statements, no yelling, no nothing no, out. that is... A Outrageous, dude. Do you have any weapons in the car? No, I don't. I'm not allowed to have any. After some time, the cops made a disturbing discovery in the suspect's car. Are you on, on probation? Bond. You're just on bond, no I'm probation. Bond. No guns or anything in the car. Nothing that's gonna look like a gun. No BB guns or anything crazy like that. I got rid of all my guns after I arrested the last time. Okay. <laughs> Who yelled out the window at the kid? I don't know. I was playing music. Were you sitting there in the same spot you were? In the back seat behind the driver? Yeah. Was there a fourth person in the car, Brady? No. He didn't drop anybody off from that time until we. Are you so dressed up today? I'm always he always looks good, man. Nah, no, there's no right now. Remember me when I stopped you and Jade? Yeah. Yeah, you did. You didn't say you were gonna get a gun or yank a shoot him or something like that? No, I just graduated high school. That's weird. Sure. He said they made no statements, no threats, yep. no yelling, no nothing. That's what he said, too. But he did say that they had come back from Toma. He does have a black mask in his thing, but he denied having it on. And all that you said to the kid was bad at football? Might have said you suck at football. Oh, suck at football. Now we're getting some. <laughs> So you guys were trying to drive past the school, kid dropped a football, you yell out the window, hey man, you suck at football. <laughs> and then what happened? We drove away. Hey, uh, Terry, here. There you go. Hang on a minute, go a little bit slower, those statements. 95 times 3. Okay. Yeah, pause, buddy. Um, they said it was all three of them. And these, he said these were the three that were in the car that went around. Okay, all right, yeah. they're comfortable. The three of them got arrested, and they tried to talk their way out of it. Unfortunately for them, it was way too late. Hunter, I need you to go ahead and put your hands behind your back for me. I'm placed under arrest now based on uh, Officer Roden's request. No, you're being placed under arrest for disorderly conduct and jail jumping. Well, based on some statements made by the complainant, they must have uh, described you good enough where she's comfortable arresting you. Hold on, what's going on with this wrist here, partner? Is it broken or anything? Actually, just let's hold off on this then. You're under arrest, okay? We're not going to put you in cuffs, though. Do you understand that? Yeah. Okay. So I'm not, I'm not going to mess your wrist up anymore. Oh, well, hey, you stand up, though. we got to just put the handcuffs on you. Just put your head behind your back, please. Walk right back to my skirt. Let me slide in there. Hope they feel good about themselves. So. No way I can't just get like ticket or something. Maybe, yeah. Because I'm on bond yeah. right now and if okay. I go back, I'm, I had court like two weeks ago mm -hmm. and they said that if I get arrested again, my charges are going to be, they're trying to get it revoked right now, okay. but they said I have a chance to like get out of all the trouble okay. for the state. Alright, well, i tell you what, let me go talk to Officer Roden and I'll get you your answers in a little bit, okay? I don't care, give me as much okay. tickets as I want, yeah. I'm just trying to stay out of jail. Okay. She spoke with the officer on scene, okay, she said she got probable cause, I'm not going to sit and have her explain it to me right now, okay, she's a veteran officer, so. Where'd that, that mask go? Okay, well, I'm going to take that as evidence though. You need to get out, sir? I oh, thought, okay. I thought we were blocking you. Student center. All right, you're good to go. Yeah, thanks for your yeah. service. Thank you. Just grab a seat for me and then we'll uh, talk to Officer Roland and see what we got going on, okay? The vehicle was searched, revealing shocking things. Hey, be careful. There's a bunch of rolls in here. There's a lot of them. Wait, when you pulled over me and Jade, were you just waiting for us to drive by? No, I was actually on my way home. Someone saw the vehicle and we knew we had to talk to you guys. And I was the closest one. Anything sharp in there? It might poke me, stick me, anything like that? No. Hunter, when it gets about time, when we have to move your vehicle, will you give us permission to leave? This is illegal, bro. I didn't do anything. Will you give us permission? Why am I being under arrest? I advise you, you're under arrest for disorderly conduct. When was I being disorderly? Okay. When? When? we're at the school, I explained it to you. How? Okay. How was I being disorderly? Yelling profanities and threats. When did I yell? Where is the proof of me yelling at people? It's from multiple kids. But anyway, I can get like, just like a sig bond out here. Because I talked to an officer a while ago, and he, apparently, I guess you guys can do that. It depends on what the alleged offense is. Unfor when? Unfortunately for you. Unfortunately, it's the kids that had to hear this. I didn't yell at okay. any kids. When it comes to time to move your vehicle, will you give us permission to move it? No. Okay. You might be going. I don't know. I'm just shooting. Sure you know. Try to just do whatever you can and not look. Yeah. get me in jail, I guess. I get you. Thing number two, Alex, there's a bunch of rounds in your bag. Yeah, I know. I guess I knew that was in there. There's no gun, though. There's not going to be a gun in the car. Mm. Okay. All right, sit tight. You just turn, sit down and then slide your feet on there. All right. 
Uh, you good, Brady? You want the window down Take a little bit? No, but what's happening? What am I doing? Well, we're gonna head over here. I'm gonna collaborate with my partner. I'm not trying to go to jail for the first time for this. You never been to jail before? No. -uh. The worst ticket I ever got was an underage drinking. Okay. Guys got everything in this. All right, Alex. So here's kind of the deal right now. So we're waiting on a canine for the vehicle because of kind of what happened. Um, I spoke to Tim Grunke. He said due to evidence of the offense, there's enough there because of the bullets and the threats to kill. Okay. Um, so we're going to search it. Thanks, Murray. Good job, buddy. Good job. Good job. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're a good dog. You're a good dog. Everything else is good, not Alaska? No. Oh, it's no. It's service week, so. Oh, sure. Absolute, absolute nightmare. Just a bottle of Patron, Terry. Yeah. Hunter. Under that seat. The passenger seat. Because of their violent history, the three of them were about to be sent to jail. Find a lot of no, we didn't find any. So how did the dog hit? The dog didn't hit. So I just searched my vehicle. It was searched for evidence of the offense of the threats to with the ammunition in your buddy's backpack. Oh. What did they say about me? I was yelling that I was gonna. Well, that's what was said. That was yelled. It was. Dude, this is gonna be so fun in court. You guys are gonna look stupid. I'm sorry that you think it's funny because you have. What's well, funny? I said you guys are gonna look stupid. Oh, okay. I love when they're gonna show the video of me yelling at them, man. And I'm being sarcastic, by the way. Brady, how are we doing back here? It still sucks. With our investigation here, we've got a disturbance was definitely created, and some kids got pretty scared uh, with some grown adult men yelling stuff out the window at them. It's not something that we take lightly when it comes to this kind of stuff. The charge is disorderly conduct. We'll be going to jail with that charge, all right? What? Yeah. How am I going to jail for that? You can't just go spouting off, you know, whatever you want. Uh, scaring these little kids. Imagine if you're a little kid and uh, you had a, a car with full-grown adult men yelling stuff that they're going to, they're going to, yeah, they're going to, whatever. Scared the heck out of these kids, you know what I mean? Yep, just make sure you behave through the booking process. You know, they got to take your fingerprints and your photo and this and that. Is this gonna be like the Walmart mug shots? I don't know anything about the Walmart thing. Well, they just make you stand up against the wall and smile at the camera. However, the driver still didn't take the situation seriously. He just had to be smart. What citation am I giving? Uh, false ID and... Uh, false ID? Yeah. How's that false ID? ID in your wallet, it's not yours. Throwing the book at me, aren't you? Doing my job. Your job is harassing people. Well, if you feel this is harassment. I do, I honestly do. Okay, I'm sorry you feel that way. Nah. Yeah. It's not Alright, brother. We'll grab a seat. Where, oh where can I park my little car? Lady. One leg out, stand Don't up. You said this is your first time here? Daddy, what's up? Actually, it's sitting over here on this First little chair on the big chair. Thank you, sir. Now that I'm tired of this Miley Cyrus right here. Have a seat. Yes, there you go. In the end, the driver was charged for making terrorist threats, disorderly conduct, and two counts of bail jumping. The other two were charged with making terrorist threats and disorderly conduct as well. But that didn't stop them, as they were arrested again a few months later. Next up are the daring teenagers who led the cops on a wild chase after bringing firearms to school. Stop right there! Put your hands up! Why are you running? Me. What the hell? On the 14th of September 2022, police officers tracked down teens who allegedly brought guns and masks to school. Upon arrival at the school, the suspects led the cops on a frantic foot chase. Hey guys, come on here. All for you. Come on. Detain them. What? You're, you're being detained. What? Detain them. What? Detain, detain them. what I'm getting detained for? Don't. 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 What I'm getting detained for? Ray, Ray, stop, 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 stop. Hey! Come on. 
up to one of the teenagers. At this moment, he was about to realize how much trouble he was in. Go, go, go. Stop right there. Put your hands up. Put your hands up right now. Put your hands up. Hands up. Turn around. Put your hands up. Hands up. Hands up. Hands up. Don't reach for it. Don't reach for it. All right? I got a belt. We got one, one fire on. We got cuffs. Hey, we're checking out the tank. Shoreway, West 25. Should we go to the one with the gun? Yeah. Okay. They weren't coming, still going, honey. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Come on, we'll get it. Come on, we'll get it. You were detained behind 4701. Huh? Stop, go get the car. Got it going on the radio. Stop, get the car, man. Okay, we'll free call the more one. The other one's going to school. Okay. Or the school. Hey, go over. Anybody with those cars? 81, 81, 32. I'm with a couple guys here. On the shoreway. Thank you. What's your call? 81, 81, 32. He was cuffed at the back of the car with nowhere to go. What the other two going to school? What's the description of those guys? I got my cuffs somewhere along. I did too. You good? We have one more going. One outstanding still. Can we put him in your car until uh, Stoke gets here? Come on. Oh, man. You got him? Yeah. Hey, Rick, I'm gonna grab the gun. You're good. Everybody read to your rights. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to attorney if you cannot afford one. So we do. We don't have enough to go. All right. There's four. We have three. There's four total. One went to the shoreway. Three ran south. Down 48. Eventually, police also caught up to the other suspects. Like most spoiled kids, it didn't take long for them to complicate an otherwise calm situation. Why are you running? Get hard in front of you. Lost the pair here. We're at one house east of 4708 Clinton to the time of the back. Why are you guys running then? If there's nothing to run for, why are you running? Right? What do you got on you? Get up, man. Where are your boys at? Tell me. Why are you running? Because you're always grabbing me. What the hell? You ran before we got to you, man. It don't matter what it's all grabbing me for. Right, Where are you going? You got none on you? Okay, y'all let me go and do it. No! Oh, what I do? Calm down. You, just ran. Be retained for what? You was you came up to me for no reason first. Well, we would have told you we that. We would have just told you. Why was y'all grabbing me though? Why are y'all coming for us and huh? we're leaving? Too hot out anyways. You got a gun. I don't know. I think I lost it. 
Yeah. Wanna go look back there? I got him out here. It appeared their troublesome behavior had been ongoing for a long time. Do they all come in different cars? Yeah, yes, these are the ones that have been, they were driving all crazy right, records on Detroit the last couple of days since last week. Almost hitting people and just driving because it was this one and it was that one yesterday. Right, contact the school. The administrator let him in the building when we tried to grab him. In the end, one of the teenagers ended up locked up in the detention center for having a gun on him. The other kids arrested were sent home to wait as a juvenile prosecutor reviewed their cases for more charges. In the next case, cops encountered the most violent 13-year-old ever. On the 10th of March, 2022, officers received a call from a school reporting a 13-year-old female student who was causing a disturbance after an altercation with a fellow student. When the officers arrived at the scene, they soon realized that they were dealing with a crazy and entitled teenager who had a lot of awful attitudes to throw around. Ah, oh, who's that lucky? He is, you're it's right. Here. Cool. Come on. No. We're not going back over there. Come no. On. There's no one in here that's going here. Move. 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 It's gotta end. Can you do that? Move! Can you go in that room okay, and chill? Okay, move! Go ahead. I'm gonna trust you. No. Shut up. Nah, bro, we ain't gonna hit really f***ing ass with his dumb f***ing head. But that's what we're trying to prevent. We're trying to prevent that. Go ahead. He's not in this room. It's a floor. Take a breath. The cops had thought that by treating her nicely, they would be able to get her to cooperate with them. However, they would soon realize that they had greatly underestimated her awful nature. Leave me that alone. We need that for uh, lunch or something, okay? Y'all want to No, come on. It's not necessary. Nah, bro, keep Well, you didn't help with that. Okay, we all sit there and f me. Yes, we could do that. You're lucky you ain't in handcuffs right now. Bro, you lucky I'm not trying to go to jail today. Cause if I was, I would have got your gun and shot your ass. Nope. I would have tried. Where would that get you? It's not gonna solve nothing. Man, I wouldn't have cared if I wanted to go to jail tonight, bro. You lucky I just got at 21, bro. Three weeks ago. The day I came to school, the day I got at fucking 21, bro. At this point, it was clear that she felt like she was sitting right above the law and was completely untouchable. But what she didn't know was that her attitude was about to put her in a very nasty situation. You think that scares me? No, it doesn't. Let me tell you damn well, I'm going to try to go back there. Okay, that's what we're trying to prevent. We can't let you go. hands on me to make the whole situation worse. Okay, guess what? I didn't mean to throw that at you. Turn around. Get on the door. We're not playing this. Now you're going to jail. If you want to continue playing like this, now you're going to jail for battery on law enforcement. That's how you want to do this? Then that's how we'll do it. We gave you that opportunity to chill out. But if you want to play this game, we'll play it. That's SRO 107. Show me out on a bat, Leo. My status is 10-4. I need a unit for transport. I got me. Hey, there's a Sean. You want to play this? That's how we'll play it. Can I have the code for that test for that student? 
Oh, and it's all on camera, Layla. I don't care. What was that, applesauce or something? Mm -hmm. Ain't got to be this way. I don't care. Well, you should. You just got out doing 21? So you're probably getting 21, just so you know. Man, f it. I don't care, bro. If I do this shit, I don't care right now, bro. You look at it and hit you in your chest with that yep. Yes, I don't care if this shit is on camera. Well, you know, that's fine. Realizing that she was going to jail, she began to reveal that this was not her first encounter with police officers in the past. The last time, these cops didn't, didn't put these at all. Didn't like, put handcuffs on No, you? they did. When I went to 21, they did. But, like, they were so loose that I could easily sip them up, put them on my feet, put them on my wrist. Like, I she could going into your car, I, like, Just... The man didn't even freaking lock them. He didn't lock the cuffs. Yeah, okay. Last time, the man didn't That's even lock That's very SRO with me, sir. He didn't even lock them? Nope. That's terrible. Layla, you know why you're going to jail, right? Yep. Battery gets an officer. Eventually, while being transported to jail, it started becoming clear to her that she wasn't so untouchable after all. That's, hurting, bro. That's because you keep moving your wrist. You I'm can't. moving them because they're hurting. So if you move your wrist, there's a, the reason we tell you to put your hands like this and face, face each other is because that's the way the bone falls in your wrist. If you sit there and you turn your wrist, guess what's gonna happen? Guess where it's gonna ride? On that bone. It hurts right there, right? It's out. I, I know. So. Why can't I just keep them all, bro, in the front? Because that's not our policy. She wanted to know why you couldn't give her a free ticket. <laughs> a free ticket for what? Bro, get a jail free card for Monopoly. Because you threw a damn applesauce at me. That's I didn't cool. mean to. You did. You said no, F you corporal and threw it at me. You said F you corporal and then threw no, it at me. I didn't. <laughs> I said sit. And then threw the applesauce. Yes, yeah, so I didn't mean to throw it at him. At my knee. I didn't mean to throw These it at you. These are my good pants too, man. These are even the ones with the busted clouds. Uh, That's all right. Look. Uh, hey, man. No hard feelings. I got to take action. Uh, 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 see? You it's all on camera. No hard feelings. I got to take action. Hopefully you get out. You it's a personal event. I'm, that I am personally offended. You are personally going to make better choices I and not throw not blue applesauce at somebody in green, right? That's the right. I can't well, hear what you're saying. You, she's not going to make better choices, especially when you're around. You will. I think you will. In the end, she was charged with battery against a police officer. If that caught your interest, brace yourself for a suspended student who was determined to attend school. On the 25th of July, 2023, police officers were dispatched to a school in reference to a suspended student who refused to leave the premises. Little did they know that this was only the beginning of an intense situation. Okay, where are you trying to get her to? I, I want her in Lippa's office. At this point now, she needs to go to the front office. All right. All right, I'm going to tell you, this is what I'm going to tell you, okay? You probably need to get the phone over to Corporal so we can talk to Mom. Or I can talk to Mom. Either we go to the front office or they've already said, all right, they've already said you're suspended. So if you go in that building, I'm going to put you in No, they're literally on me right now. Back the up. All right, no. Get the off me, bro. Get off me. Stop. Get the off me. Stop. Get the off of me. 
excuse me, this bro. Whole thing is unnecessary. It's no, my mom is calling me. Stop. Me. Oh, for me. Get the f off of me, bro. You're weird. Get the f off of me. Like any other Karen, the teenage girl was determined to get what she wanted. However, things did not go in her favor. Oh, get the f off! Get the f off of me! I don't give a f Listen, Alright, get on your stomach. You're touching me right now, dog. Get on your stomach. Off of me! I'm not going nowhere till my mom gets here, bro. What the f? That's not how this works. You're doing this for no reason right now. What the f, nigga? Off of me, bro. Okay. Get the off of me. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Please get off me. I don't like it. I can't breathe. Please don't like it. Okay, I'll get up. Just please stop. Okay, I'll get the off. Put your hands behind your back. I'm not getting on the floor. You get pick me up and I'll put them behind my back. I will once I get the up. My God, I'm not getting. I'm not going on my back. Give me handcuffs. I'm not getting on the floor. I'm just the f get me your arms. I'm no, you're not getting up. He just said I can. I'm not He's not pushing me on the ground. All right, look. put your hands behind your back. I'm gonna stand the f up. What the f do? No, I said no. The suspect's mum arrived to save the day, but she was too late. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these off you. I'm gonna put your hand on top of your head afterwards, okay? That way we can put different ones on. Pass go to SSG121. Put hand on top of your head. Put it on top of your head first. Point to it. That one on top of your head also. So, do you want to take your bracelets off and leave them with your mom, or do you want them to go with you? Do you want to take them? What about your necklace? Could they take it off? Yeah, they're going to make you take all that off. I'll give it to mom. You want got some inklets? I can't take off my Okay, I got you. You're not going to fall. Is that it? Yeah, that one can't come off. Okay. Those can't come off? You better shove your nose ring all the way up in there. What? They take off the nose ring? They might. I don't know. They probably will make you take it off. Shove it in there. What the hell? Everybody's at the signal four with an 81-year-old male conscious oh. breathing. Like I said, they'll call you here in, in a little bit to come pick her up. Like I said, okay. I, that's if she doesn't point out. I cannot imagine with this being her first arrest that she would point out. Okay. So she... No promises because I don't have the sheet in front of me, but I could I cannot imagine her going to JEC, so they'll most likely be calling you to pick her up today. Okay. Okay. All right. And can I have you come back in with me so we can get yeah. more school paperwork? Can you let me back in? Right. Right. Yeah, I'm heading back to my office. 
In the end, the teenage girl was charged with battery on law enforcement. In the next case, things escalate dramatically when an entitled mum faces the most severe karma imaginable. On January the 9th, 2023, a school resource officer in Oklahoma responded to a report of a mother using profanity and engaging in an argument in the school's front office. Little did the SRO realize that this situation would soon turn out to be chaotic. Oh, are you yes, because I know she's not calling people B-words. Excuse me? B-words, are you using profanity? I'm asking you a question. Are you talking Yes, ma'am. Are you using, well, that's what I was talking. That's why I'm just coming to ask you. I've been question. standing right here the whole time. Ma'am, have you, have you heard me say anything? Did you say Did you say it to the other lady that was in here? No, that I, I haven't even said anything to nobody. Well, I'm just asking because that's what I was told. And if you use a profanity, you're about to leave. That's all I'm saying. Well, she can tell you right here. I have Okay, well, I'll wait for the other one to come in too and I'll ask her. Well, that's fine. Because we don't do that here. Well, it's I not. Didn't do that. Just ask. I mean, I have a right to ask. Well, I'm not screaming or hollering or are yelling. Are you talking to the right person? I, I, yes, ma'am. Who I was told was the lady in the white shirt that's standing up here trying to give a birthday present to somebody, correct? Would that be you? And so, and so who would you get this information from? Don't worry. When they come in, I'll ask okay, them. Okay, thank you. And if you, if you didn't, then obviously they heard you wrong. But I don't know why they would come tell me that that's what you said if that's not what you said. But if that's what you said, I'm gonna have, you, you're going to leave. Is there a problem? Yes, if you're using profanity in this front well, office, no there one, is. No one ever. I never said anything. Uh, I'm just asking. I never I raised my voice. A, I never said anything. You're, All you're, I did was ask for my daughter. You're raising your voice and now. And she's been here the whole time. I've been standing here. You're raising your voice now. The whole time. Yes, so I've been... I've been I just right. asked you a question. It was brought to my attention. I just asked you a simple question. But you can I, ask the lady right here. I never said She anything wasn't obviously anyway. in here. So she can't answer she's that question for time. you. The woman denied all allegations, but on her way out, her mouth betrayed her again as she unconsciously engaged in profanity once more. Something she came to regret later as it provided all the evidence the officer needed. I never used any profanity came out of my mouth. The whole time I've been standing here. Okay. So like Sounds I great. say, if there's a problem with me, y'all can address it to me. No, I'm funny, you know, the enemy professional manager. I never used profanity. That's what oh, I've been saying the whole great. time. That's right. So, so, like I said, is there a problem? Exactly is there a problem? What exactly do you need at this point? Now I'm Okay, so now, we, I, now I'm going to sign this. The woman never thought she could be arrested for using profanity in a school compound, but now Karma was on her case. Am I under arrest? Yes, ma'am. For, for what? For what? Because you can't use profanity. For what? For what? what? So please place your hands behind your back. I'm not asking you what you Excuse put me? Put your hand behind your back, Excuse lady. Excuse me? I, I asked you nicely. Excuse me? Yes. What, what am I being put? Put your other hand behind your back. So, put your other hand, thank you. So are put you your other hand, thank you very much. And you can go to jail. For what, cussing at the principal like that. What? It's profanity, man. Thank you. Stop. You've well, been on camera I, well, the whole time. Yes, and I, I'm pretty sure that. You've been on camera, well, my it, camera the whole time. Oh, yes. Audio, and video, color, all that. Uh, the, and all no, time. No, you cannot. Yes, I no. have. And then, are you, yes, are you fresh? Because you keep moving. No, no I don't I'm fresh not, women. I'm not. I'm not. So please walk I'm and not. stop moving. I did, I did everything you asked Please walk down the stairs. Thank you very much. Like you're pushing me. I'm walking you. Like I said, I asked you, was there we're a problem? We're walking to the car. Was That's there what a we're problem? Doing. We're walking towards the car. Like I said, are you pushing me? No, I'm walking And then I have somebody in the car that can help me. No, nah, you're going to jail. Okay, they well, they, well, they, how not can my they problem. drive off if I have the keys? Well, that's not my problem either, man. Like I said, what was the whole problem? There, there's never been a problem. Please I never, have a seat. I never use, I never Please use, have a seat. I never use, a, so are you? I've asked you nicely. Please have a seat for so the third what? time. Please get in the car. And I'm not, I, 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 I know I would like to speak with your supervisor before, because I, I feel You're unsafe. Under arrest. I feel unsafe. You're under arrest. I feel very unsafe. You're I feel very arrest. timid. Get because because you have been manhandling me for no, no I reason. Have it. Ma'am, it's all on camera. Yes. Nobody's yes. And thank you. Yes. But that's yes. fine. Yes. I'm asking you, can you again. Get in, so get in the car. So are you going to assault me? Get in the car. Are you going to assault me? You're under arrest. Like Would you get in the car? For what? What is my charges? It's disorderly conduct. Disorderly conduct? Yes. I, I never said anything unprofessional or anything. You didn't just cuss at the principal on camera? What did I say? When you walked out? What did I say? What did I say? I don't need sir? to repeat it. I heard it. What did I say? It. And it's on my camera. What did I say? So please sit in the car. What did I say? And then I asked you a question. 
What what is the problem? What is the big problem? All I did was come here and drop a want to drop a card off for my daughter. I don't understand the big problem. Now the woman went on to display her victim mentality by blaming others for her actions. But you cannot anything. cuss I at people when you cannot cuss at the principal. I so, did not yes, say anything belligerent. Y'all did everything to, to provoke me. No, we did not. Just we like you sitting here pushing me all that, yes. I didn't do and any then of that you either. took my phone so I couldn't yes, record because you're you. And I had every it's right to do that. I had every right to do that. You can turn it off anytime you want to. I don't do that. Yes, you When do. I deal with people, it's all. You, you can so see how the lie, way they can lie. I don't and have that's to lie fine. about anything, sir. Okay, so you didn't cuss at the principal? What did I say? You didn't cuss at the what principal? What did I say? Exactly. And as if that was not enough, she went on to act as a victim of the system, which she also tried to portray as corrupt. Use your power to try to manipulate people in the system. That is, that's sad. That is so sad. And all I did was wanted to give my daughter a birthday, so like, card? birthday card? No, sir. No, I'm not, because I'm scared so to I'm get going, in this car. So I'm going to pull you in the I'm car. I'm scared to get in this I, car, because I'm, 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 fear, I'm fearing I'm for going, my life. I'm going to pull you. You already been twisting my arm? Because you were resisting. I, I was not resisting. Yes, when I, I asked you to put your hands behind your back, you and did I, not. I asked you, because I've been All I have to do is ask you once. Be clear. But for what? Because I just only conduct. I told you What is this orderly conduct? I was asking you to put your hands behind your back. I told you several times. Obviously, you can look it up. And I've answered that question for you as well. You cannot cuss at the principal. 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 You cannot cuss at the
I don't know if you've been handcuffed or not. I don't know. I've you. never been. In, I don't that's know if you. I, 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 I don't. I don't. I don't know if you've been arrested or not, like ma'am. But all you you're doing is refusing to do what I'm asking you to do. You shoved me down the stairs, shoved me over, and said, "Get in the car." How can I? No, I asked you to get in the car twice. How can I possibly get in the car, sir? At this point, the woman had proven to be uncooperative, refusing to get inside the police car. However, the officer was determined to follow the law. Okay. That's sad. It is so sad. Yes, it's sad, sad that adults come to a school and act the way you do. It's very sad. Yes, because I've been harassed and bullied just because you're a police officer? No, I asked you a simple and question. Someone like, you answered the question and I, but and no, I stopped who, talking no to you. Ever, I stood to the no back and stopped talking No one ever said that I called a uh, cuss word. I've never, the B word never came out of my mouth. Said it ten times. Okay. Y'all have cameras in the office, okay. and you said you have one on your badge as well. Oh my, actually vest. Your badge, your vest, whatever. Badge. You have, my you have a, right a, a camera, whatever. Okay. And you said I'm, I was no, that's a lie. I never said anyone out their name. I never called anyone out their name. The officer continued to have a chat with her, which was unproductive at all, until another school personnel joined in, and it was here that the lady threw in the race card. I'm interested in why your daughter. I tell her that her mama want to see her. And she doesn't. What is the deal? She was in that room shaking. Shaking. She did not care to come interact with you. Okay. I tried multiple times. Every time I left out of the office, I went and talked to her. So, Listen, your mother wants to see you. Okay. Yada, yada, yada. Now, I have your papers right here for the okay. court case and all of that. Okay. I'm just trying to figure out why is okay. it that your okay. daughter so, don't so care to interact with you? Is that what y'all do to try you, you're to not listening. The, black, the black sisters? Okay. I'm black like you! Police backup had arrived, and the officer went on to explain his expectations to the woman, but she wasn't ready to comply with the officer. What's gonna happen now? She's gonna switch handcuffs out on you, and she's gonna put you in her car. I'm gonna get your information. Why am I I'm being a, under you're not listening. I've already told you that. Obviously, you don't remember. Well, you That's. Been, yes, I, I've remember, told you. I remember I've told you. I've told you, you several times. I've talked to you several times. You I've explained this to you several times. Like I said, you can try to antagonize me all you want to. That's not antagonizing. Because, like I said, but I'm not going to keep repeating you myself. Assault, you, I want to press charges on you for assaulting me. Okay. Is this your correct address? You, you can either give me your information or you can't. That's on you. However, the more you don't want to cooperate, the more things I'm going well, to write. I don't feel safe. To, I don't feel safe talking to you. Okay, well then I'll just write you the ticket then. That's fine. Stand, up and, turn, stand, stand up, up and turn around. Stand up. Stand up and turn around in the door. You was just seven minutes. Stand no. Stand up and turn around in the door, so she can change his handcuffs, so you can go get in her car. He told me to get in the car. I got in the car. No, you didn't get in. You're not in the car. You have never once got in the car. I'm in the car. How could I possibly get in the car? Okay. Stand up and turn around so we can switch these handcuffs out. That means turn around. Turn around. Thank you. I'm glad you like your job. You don't like your job a lot, either. You need to do something else that you do. Besides assault women. Okay. You look so beat up. See, that's easy. She said it. She said it without a problem. Without pushing me in twisting my arm. No, because when I asked you to put your hands behind your back, you refused. Well, you you That's when I grabbed your arm and twisted you it you because you refused to put your hands behind your back. That's why you're getting the resist. That's, That's, That's why you're going to get the resistant arrest want. ticket. I never That's fine. Resisted. I never resisted, okay. sir. Okay. So well, obviously, you, obviously, you don't know what resisting you arrest is. Can you ask him why am I being placed yeah. under arrest? Yeah, it's called disorderly conduct for the fifth so time I've told you. Yes, and for resisting arrest. So I you are going to count. I never resisted arrest. Okay. Well, maybe you, I never you, you, resisted maybe arrest. you don't understand, but I that's okay. Go to her car. And can, you yeah, I, I will give all your stuff. We could have did all of this if you would have gotten the car. I'd have had the paperwork done and tickets wrote, but now you got to wait another 10 minutes because you refused to do what I was asking you to do. So I'm going to ask you again. Is this your correct address? For the well, second time. I don't even know what's well, okay, where do you live? I couldn't even. I asked well, well, okay, ma'am. Okay, ma'am. Okay, ma'am. Ma ma we'll we'll pass that. that. Where do you live? Can you please talk to me and send okay. where, where do you live? Whatever's on that. Whatever on Thank my you. ID. In the end, she was charged with disorderly conduct and resisting arrest. Next is a case about a defiant 13 year old who thought she was above the law just because she was a minor. Oh, wait, listen, I just have my hand. No, who cares? I don't. Okay, well. Hush it up. On the 7th of March, 2023, the police were called to a school because of a drunk minor. When police arrived, they didn't expect to meet the most entitled kid ever. Come here. She just yep, dropped it's right there. Now. Pass. 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 Pass.
It's not in here. We just no, saw it. It's right there. It's not right here. Just, unless you guys want to see my fucking underwear. Hmm? Can you she give it to him? Just dropped down. It's fine. Yeah, it's right there. It's right there. It's in her house. It's in her It's right there. I can see the it's bulge in, in her house. house. It's Where? right there. Where? I can see the bulge. What bulge? She has it right there. Were you guys want to look at my underwear or what? No, I do not, ma'am. I bet you guys do because you guys keep assuming. Not assuming. It's right there. I see the lips. See? Yep. No, you're not. Yeah, Pull that out. Know. Whatever it is. Pull it out. No. There's nothing in there. Yeah. Well. Why should I do it? Touch my pee or what? It's no. right there. That's my bone. No, it's The entitled kid, still being hostile, called her mother to pick her up. But this wasn't going to do her any good. You can't have your phone. Tell you. Put your phone down. Yeah, you you give us her phone. Come on. Who are you calling? You calling mom. Your mom? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay you can't. You're yeah, you can't hold my phone. I mean, you're going to get charged. I'm going to get charged? Yes. Mom, um, the, they have me in the office or some shit. They're trying to say I have a or some shit. Are you going to her? Yeah. I don't know, Peter Pulos. Come pick me up or some shit, man. I feel like he's. Yeah, man. Don't play with it. Hold on. Why are you staring at me? Okay, look down at the other right there. Please. I know, okay, man. It's because I was holding over there. Come here. Shut up. Mm -hmm. Have you? No. Okay. Nothing. It's too bad. I hold your child. Okay, knock it out with a language behind. No. Okay. If I, if you know what, I can put you in cuffs and beat you, uh, no, put you under arrest. Cuffs. Okay. Okay, no then knock it off with the language. You. Even after the police talked to her, she still verbally abused them and the other staff. She probably didn't expect what was coming her way. That's awful. Oh, you guys can't have my phone. Just like I said. That's my phone. They're over there trying to take it and shit. And then when he walks in, you guys stop. Like, what? We'll wait for no, your mouth. No, I didn't stop because he's doing it. Could you pull it away? I'm not going to fight you for it. Well, I was trying, trying to take I it. I can sure tell you were trying to. No, wait, listen, I just have my phone. No, I'm listening. No cares. I don't. Okay, well, hush it up. Okay, yeah. Knock it off. Okay, knock it off. Okay. Oh, you too. Okay. Oh, hell no. Hell no. Okay. Hell no. 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 Hell no
I'm recording everything. Oh, you okay? Especially you doing that shit or what? Oh, you guys didn't record that part, huh? I'm recording everything. Man, you guys didn't record the beginning, did you? Well, you threw me on the ground shit or what? The struggle continued because it still hadn't dawned on her that she could not cuss her way out of this situation. Finally, her mother arrived at the scene. They discovered quickly where she got all that courage to fight back. Her family could sue all they wanted, but she was still detained. The sad part was she was about to be set free, but kept running her mouth. Hey, I'm tying the shit. Oh, I should tighten the game. Oh. Okay, don't touch me. I don't need you touching me, all right? I'm already having your position. Here, look at right here. So much right here. Ah, uh, finally, you guys are retarded. Mm -hmm. All you need was all Man, that's retarded. It's like the easiest yeah. shit. Oh, I should f***ing hurry. You did it, you did it. You did it. You think I give a fuck? No, I didn't. Come on. Hey, go here, check my phone. Hey, check my phone. Hey, check my phone. Oh, f***ing, you fucking didn't do my phone. Check my phone right there. Check there. Come on with the portals, like, you're retarded. Fuck, that was Even though she was neck deep in trouble, she was still determined to be let go without consequences. Where's the bottle? Oh, they let you lose. Oh, no, no, she. Oh, you opened it too much. Oh, I opened it too much. Yeah. Hey, don't tie that one. Don't tie that one. That one's good. Right, well, let, me get, let me get that one then. Okay, well, come on, you try to get the other one. Are you guys retired or what? Put it in the back. No, f***. No, f***. No, f***. No, f***. No, f***. No, f***. Hey, compound my jacket. You're going to break it. Well, let it lay. No, f***. Oh, hey, you're going to break my jacket. No. Lilia, stop. F***. You hot dog. Okay, whatever. Just stop. 
Okay. 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 She still hadn't realized she was not going to win that fight. You're not gonna win. Stop fighting. You won the moment. Nice, Mike. Hold on, Delia. I'm almost there. Okay, you missed it. Don't fight this time. All right. Let me give you. I'm gonna give you a finger there. Okay. A finger there. Oh, my yeah. Okay, I said too tight. No, look. I got my finger. Don't move. I got my Don't move. All right, you're good. Thank you. Yeah, relax. Oh, I hear Larry. I hear Larry. Tell her to look how I'm going to die. No, she's supposed to stay on the lid off. She took the lid off. No, you took the lid off. What the fuck you guys need? Try and get over there. Okay, I'm waiting for the census center to call me to see if they're going to call you, okay? So just relax. If she actually behaved, things would have been different. Look at that. 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 Look at we're almost oh, done. Yeah, I'm waiting on a phone call. I'm going to f on a phone call, man. Okay, well, just wait a little bit. Do you want to go? It's over. Why do you act like a prisoner? Hello? She tired. Yes, sir. By then, she had hurt a lot of people. One of her teachers included. She was standing, threatening me. Okay. Does she, where did she hit your arms? She or didn't touch me, Officer Grapp, I would go in. No, how would you try to touch your hands? Did she shit your hands when she grabbed it? She hit my finger when she touched her skin at least? Yeah, she hit her finger. your finger? Let me see that. I just wanted to. Not even. What? Why not? You heard me. I'm not lying. Yes, you were. You were trying to take my phone? You were trying to take my phone? You were trying to grab my phone and I started to move my phone like this? And it started to pull her from me, yeah. yeah, so that's what you put in your finger because you want to have such a yeah, grip on it, okay? Yeah. 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 No, you want to no. You said that I bent it. Let me go talk to my mom. But you wanted to grab on the phone and bend like that. Custody for resisting uh, position, minor position? Yeah. Resisting yeah. a retard? Yeah. yeah, that's fine. Oh, shit, I would do a little Yeah, no shit. And that's what I just said. I said I will tell you guys. I told you guys something each. Now you said it right. No, you said Because you did. I would and I did and I don't do a that's why you gotta go to school, man, so you don't have to talk. School, man. Oh. I'd rather be at home. Okay, then. So, be nah, it's all play it online. Better it's hard. After all the drama with Delia, the cops had to face the real problem. The principal snatched the phone and hit the principal's hand. And the principal goes, I'm not gonna fight with you. I'm not gonna fight over everyone. Oh. But she, she gave her the phone back. Yeah, At that yeah, point, she got up. Yeah. She's being really disordered. Really cool. uh, she's really argumentative, cussing at everybody. And she squared off to the principals. She stood up and was coming at the principal again. So the, she didn't get hit or anything because of what she was doing. The officer grabbed her by her side. I want to reach. Okay, you, you're more than welcome. I'm now, like, because I, I got to go already. Um, I, like I said, like, I I, know, I mean, my daughter has never given me any problems. And like I said, she was like, here as a parent. I was your kid. And they say, Dad, come pick me up. I'm waiting for you here. And she says, why don't my daughter took me? And I got her and nobody would tell me. It might be the alcohol. I don't know. I don't know. Is that okay for me, though? Huh? Well, is that okay for the parents to be hysterical and nobody says nothing about their daughter? Because your daughter hasn't calmed down from now. Her mom tried to justify her daughter's actions, yet we all know it wasn't going to get her anywhere. That's not your, fair. Your, your, de your definition of the safety is not as same as ours. So we unhandcuff her and she lunges and hits the principal or staff. So keep her handcuffed out of the building. I'll I'll her. Once we release her to you, she's on handcuffs okay. and you take her. Okay. Okay. But as long as she's in our custody, she's Can I go back to them? Like, okay. Not yet. There's not enough room. There's oh, so many I people. Don't know. How, why is everybody in there though? Because she's acting out the way she I is. I know. Like, no, like, come on, not fair. Everybody does not have to be there. If she got we have two, give her a citation. We have two security okay. guards in there, two female security guards. Okay. okay. We have the principal, assistant principal, and the officer. Okay. That's how many people are in there. 
in that small world. More people on her. Yes. They're not on her. They're not touching her. They're it's not. Wrong. She's the one that's more verbal than anybody she, else. She's cussing and making, just calling people names and everything. Yeah. She, yeah. So now I'm like she's calling, she's saying, again. she's calling people hoto, she's calling this and that. No, she's so just they cussing. Were hoto, 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 like no, no, I understand. That's, like that. that's the minimum. That's also language. I know. She's just calling. She's going get very belligerent. Yeah. It's hard to call and put it on. She's she, derogatory names. Yeah. She's using it all. Okay. okay. So her so demeanor like itself, I don't live with her, so I don't know if that's her normal demeanor. No. But she's acting out in she's that way. She's a hippie student, that's why I said I have never had a problem with her. At this point in time, I don't know why she's acting out that way, but she is. Okay. And due to the safety restrictions, we're going to detain her. She's detained now, and she's being charged. As soon as we're done with paperwork and anything, she is possibly going to get suspended, obviously, from the school. I'm going to remove her from the school. Um, okay. And, but she's oh, going to get turned over right back now. to I'm sorry? She is going to get turned over when we're done, back to you. How long am I gonna be? Because apparently, whenever I call 911, you are already here. I was here. Yeah, we're already here. Yes, my first, my you first concern. Lloyd? Excuse me. Are you Mr. Lloyd? No, who, I don't know who. I thought was. Mr. Lloyd was his supervisor. See, it's all mixed. We don't have a Lloyd. There's a different thing. You're saying jump like. No, I, I they're just family. Because they're all physically abusing her. They're all like all. Nobody's her physically crap. doing anything to her. Because my daughter does not react to that. I understand. Like Nobody's that. touching her. If my daughter was like. Delia continued to complain about her handcuffs, but that should have been the least of her worries. Look how loose they are. You act like they're no, tight. No, no, bro, they're tight at first, and they're still on here, and it's still affecting. Listen. Are you retarded or what? They're I guess not. all you guys are, huh? They're not intended for you to be keep moving around. No, they're not intended to be on me. Who are they intended to be on? I don't give a on. Why are you asking questions that you don't want to listen? You. Okay. You. Whoa. What is she talking about? Stupid. Start cussing out like. And what about it? Hey, what the fuck's my phone for real? Mm -hmm. Hey, get my phone. Your mom's not in the building. No, I'll leave this bitch dry. I don't give a fuck about it. Hey, when are you gonna get my phone? I'm gonna give it to you. I'm gonna release you to her. Well, why don't you just give it to her right now, or when she, you see her, or whatever the. Yeah. yeah, you should have raided that. Like, what the? Are you holding on to my phone? That's a retarded, retarded. Nah, there's still gossiping. There's other stuff going on besides you. Oh, really? You think I give a? I'm not talking about. Okay, shut up. You, you, don't give a. You, you shut up. Outside hallway. I don't give a. This is another. Okay. Have ears, okay? You guys have ears. I'm go. You're right. It's nothing important. Okay. If you don't care, then you don't ask the question. Shut up, okay? My eyebrows. Why do you guys take long ass? I swear, what the are you guys trying to do? Take out there, but. I'm not trying to take any more time than we need to. I'm not really good at taking your time. For sure. Central, That's all you have to press? Yes. Retarded. Finally, you have Wait out, wait out. Hey, what the f*** happened to my computer? Your mom has it. Are you sure? Yes. Ah, oh, finally. Wait out. Ah, oh, f*** you bitches. Wait on my f***. You wanna Shut up. I'm gonna f*** you. I'm not gonna see you again. Alright. Let's go. Oh, that's your mom. This is what she has. This is what she has. She was finally released, but the day didn't end there. Um, and my daughter's on my nerve. Okay. to me. Okay. Okay, so obviously um, there has to be reason that any kind of officer uses force. And what about a camera? Should he have? Yep. Is he supposed to have a camera on at all times? Yes. With minors? Yes, correct. Yes, most okay. definitely. Most okay. definitely. I brought up also, and I'm sorry, an incident that happened on March the 7th on Tuesday at Sierra Middle School. Okay. The things that he did was appropriate, you know, getting my daughter up on the headlock, going on the ground. And having all these other securities, like, get on top of my daughter. One of them was even sitting on top of my daughter. Okay. And I want to know, um, 
Because I'm sure it would be anybody else's kid. If somebody says, hey, this person threw me down. And then mm-hmm. somebody hits me, I took an assault because they threw me on the ground. And my daughter's only 13. The officer threw me on um, a charge on that officer for battering my daughter. Because he has no right, regardless of what they're trained, nobody has a right to uh, throw anybody on the ground and have them bang their head and okay. keep their head, their, their leg press on their, on their head for what? In the end, she was charged with battery on school personnel, resisting, and a minor in possession of alcohol. Moving on to the father who got defensive after pulling a firearm during a road rage incident. You're what? taking the word of well, someone you taking, don't know. I'm not taking anyone's word. You know, what I'm telling you is we have we have a complaint that a firearm which was presented, okay, at a school. You understand that? Uh, did I present it at a school? I just pulled in. Look, oh, sir, don't you guys have cameras? All I need you to do is step out of the car, sir. And this guy can run me just, off the road and just, drive away. Where's no, no, he at? We'll Where is he at? We'll address that. Where is he at? He we'll drove away that. already, no. motherfucker. You're not listening we'll to me. Address that. You gotta you're not going to address it because he's you gotta done. Calm down. How can that be calm? Is, I know you're upset. I know you're upset. Listen. No, you don't understand. Listen, 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 listen. I don't even know you. You don't work here. Before, I'm, a I'm police here every day. Officer. I'm a police officer. Before we go any further, what I need to do is You're going to make me look like a criminal in front of all these fucking parents. I'm not trying to make you look like anything. Yes, you are. What you're doing is you're elevating. What I need you to do is calm down. I am elevating. Why would I not elevate? If someone ran you off the road, would there does not have to be a scene. Can you answer that question, though? There does not have to be a scene here. Okay. I've answered all your questions. Can you answer mine? What I need to do is remove you from the car. Okay. And then we'll discuss it further because I need to remove you from the fire. I'm pushing the button. Okay. I know I'm brown and you guys like fucking shooting us. God damn it. I want to get my son and go home. Being polite, the officer remained focused on the complaint about the firearm, but Vincent could not hold his anger. He just let his emotions run wild. Did you call anybody for that? Answer my goddamn question. Listen, sir. Answer my question. You're gonna force me to do some things I don't want. What are you gonna do? For what? Am I threatening you? I need you. My hands are behind my back. I need you to calm down. Just calm down and we'll figure it out, man. Things happen and you get frustrated. It's normal. It's a normal. He can commit a crime. No, he can't. He just ran the red light and ran me up the road. You haven't done shit. We'll 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 figure that out, man. Oh my god! You're not gonna figure out. You guys never figure out. You fuck with me and criminals can drive away. Okay. Listen, what's your name, man? My name's Vinny. Vinny I have a license here. Can I reach for it? Or are you going to shoot me? I'm saying. You're threatening me while I'm picking up my son at school. It's a vape. Listen, listen. (laughs) Calm down. Calm down. I'm not calm. I'm sick of getting whipped by you guys. You you see my demeanor? We can work through this. Do I seem like I'm irate, irrational? All I know is the guy who just ran me off the road just drove away. That's what I know. From my perspective, runs red light. From my perspective, is that against the law? Fine. No, it's not. It's not against the. It's not. It's not okay. It is against the law. But listen to listen to what I'm saying, okay? From my perspective, all I have is this information. Where'd you get that information? Listen to me. Listen to me, sir, for a second. I'll let you talk. I've got parents screaming at a school that someone presented a firearm. What parent? Okay. Show me him. Okay. Show me my accusers. Parents and teachers. That's, that's, multiple. Like okay, show people, me okay? Show me my accusers. So that's what I'm responding to. Ten people to. told you that? Multiple people. I didn't say I, I want to see my accusers okay. right now. That's that's okay. the law. I took criminology. Okay. I can see my accusers. Who are they? We will get we will get to the bottom I want of that, it. I want that information but sent you, to you. You got you to calm down and be a I am calm. I'm f***ing calm as f***. This is how I talk. I'm from New York, mother This is how we talk. After a short chat with Vincent, the officer got a bit skeptical. Vincent was getting defensive and repeatedly demanded to see his accusers, going on about some incident where he got forced off the road. Where's your ID at? In my pocket. I told you that f***ing 10 minutes ago. Let me have that, please. In America, we're allowed to have them. That's right, you are allowed Yeah, we're allowed to have them. Motherfuckers, are not allowed to run you off the road, not allowed to run red lights, but he's f***ing gone. How the f*** do you sleep at night? Can you get with Don't chamber my shit when it wasn't chambered, motherfucker. What's that? Can you get with staff, find out what happened? Yeah. Well, you have multiple accusers. They all ran inside. They should yeah, all know. Yeah, they're all inside. Miss okay. Martinet knows me personally. Get the f*** out of here. Just, 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 just find out what Ms. happened. Miss Martinet, the one that was right here who I told what was going on. Where'd she go? I don't know. I had to f- uh, get accused of being a criminal. The officer chose to further push the interrogation after his instincts told him that Vincent was hiding something. I want to know how the multiple teachers here f- know what happened over there. Because it's a lie, goddammit. Okay. Right. You know, my son's right there. I want to go home, bro. I didn't commit a f- crime. That guy did. Where's he at? The crime guy gets to go away. You guys are f- He wanted to start a fight that he wasn't man enough for. 
So he's going to go hide in your ass. Running me off the road. You're not going to do shit about that. That's fine. I want to see that cocksucker right here. I want him to tell you to your face that he didn't do shit. We're going to find out what happened, okay? No, you already know what happened according to you. You got multiple I witnesses. I don't know anything, man. All, 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 all I was trying Fucking to tell lies. you is, is what That was a lie. I want to hear the multiple people say, he ran to some guy and told him shit. And then there was a duck duck goose game and then everybody said, yeah, we all seen it. And that's a fucking lie. It's a lie. You got, you guys got traffic cams right there. Look. Look at the footage. And we, we live in government spy network. You guys can access fucking videos. Throughout the interrogation, Vincent's behavior remained hostile and disrespectful. The officer saw that dealing with Vincent could become a challenge, prompting him to call for backup. Are you heading up here? Uh, can I get my phone and let my wife know what's going on? I got some units here. It's on my door I've handle. got things trying phone, to figure please? out what the hell exactly happened. I just know I was directing traffic. Am I being arrested? Because this is against the law. You can't hold me. Right now, you're not free to go. You have 30 minutes. I know law. I went to college, not jail. No, they all ran inside and locked down to a red, so I'm just standing out here with a guy. I've got... I have no idea. That's, that's what I've got. Some They're there and they're trying to figure that out now, so... I want this lame, lying to come over here and tell you the truth. That's what I want. No, he's not secure. He's just very upset. But, uh, yeah, the, the weapon is secured. Yeah, so. No, but I want to get the car line going. So I'll, I'll get his car parked and we'll get these patrol cars out of the car line and get it going. Okay. Okay. They got to find a crime to accuse me of. They got to find a crime to accuse me of. At this stage, tensions were still running high, with Vinny insisting on being a victim of the other driver who provoked the incident. In the meantime, his vehicle had been searched and the findings validated the officer's suspicions that Vincent was hiding something. Put that in, the, in my front seat, passenger seat. Yeah, right there. Yeah. Why are you taking my I'm not taking it. I'm just no, putting you're it. not. He is. He's putting it in my car. On my Why? Section. I'm putting it away for a second. I'm putting it in a safe location, okay? This is still a school, man. Where's the... Did you guys let him go? That's what I want to know right now. Is he here? You're not going to answer my question? I've answered all yours? All right. Is my accuser here or did you let him go? You're not under arrest. I'm securing you're you right not putting now. that on I'm me. putting it on you, and if you resist, if you I'm not under arrest, you're not putting that I'm on me. I'm securing you for safety reasons, okay? You're, what you're safety? Under arrest. Okay, until we figure out what's going on. Oh I'm my you, okay? God. Oh my God. Vincent's confrontational attitude persisted, leading him to be placed in handcuffs. He was subsequently charged with having a weapon near school property and aggravated assault with intent to commit a felony. Next up is the rebellious teenager who left her parents to deal with all of her issues. On the 24th of August 2022, police officers responded to a possible overdose. Instead, they were met with one of the most outrageous arrests ever. What are you doing? Let's go. Don't, don't, or you're going to get thrown on the ground. You understand? You want to play this game and act like you don't hear me? Bro, why are you boring me like that? I have so many. Because you don't know how to listen. Let's go. Okay, don't touch you know. me. Try to swing on me. Keep I'm it not up. swinging on you, bro. Stand up. Ow, Stand up. Ow. You better stop. Oh, you'll be alright. Well, why the f 
got a screen play like that, that's why I got so many bruises on me. Not for me? Yes, from you guys. I'm fing dead. Maybe you should listen. I've been listening. I wasn't doing nothing but fing laying on the fing thing. Is that why you're walking across the street and I told you to come here? Because they wanted me to leave, so I fing left. I'm gonna make you leave school. I'm dead. They said I had to fing leave. What does she mean by I'm dead? Things took a surprising turn when it was revealed that nobody wanted to help the teenager. At that point, the police gave the teenage girl a talk she would never forget. I'm coming. Yeah, no problem. Your daughter Mercedes? Yes. Do you put her as a runaway? I did. Um, oh. If you could just let me clock out and I'll be right outside. Oh, you don't have to clock out. That's what I was going to ask you. Is it your boyfriend or something? Yes, but he's, she's going to fight with him. I. Okay, yeah, yeah that's what I wanted to find out who... I want to make sure we release her to somebody. I just need parents, to give so. them a number and then um, okay. I'll be right out. Okay, no problem. Um, if you want to go to Los Montañas in the front, that's okay. Where they're at, right there. I will. He, okay. he should be on his way. Okay, I think he's there already, but I just wanted to make sure. Me and Dad, because like I said, I was on the phone with Dad. Uh -huh. we, we already know how she is. We've been having trouble with her for the past two years. Yeah. And she's been running away. Like, if I take her home right now, she's literally going to fight with me. I don't know if you guys are able to take her to jail to sober up or. Well, whatever. I don't. And the thing is, I don't know if she's per se under the influence. I think it's just her attitude, yeah, kind okay. of, is what it seems like. I don't know if she's yeah. been medically checked out. Yesterday, so when I went, got home from grocery shopping, uh -huh. she had three of her friends in my home. I kicked her friends out, and that's why I called the cops because she ran away. Yeah. But they had alcohol in my home. Yeah, and that, that's what I looked so we could get your updated address because she says, oh, no, I don't know my address. My mom's homesick of COVID. I don't have her number. I said, take this off. Put your hand on top of your head. Do you understand? Do you understand? Put your hand on your head. Okay. Can you grab your phone? Uh, your mom's inside, I guess, dissing or running around you from school, whatever it may be. Uh, the school no longer wants you to attend here. Um, I am going to turn you over to him, but essentially it's going to be turned over to mom. She has a little bit of paperwork, and I will take you out of the system as a runaway. I will give you some advice. Uh, if you keep running away or whatever these little charges you think are nothing, they will become enough where you will be taken to jail. Um, I requested detention today to take you to jail, and they didn't. But I can tell you, if you keep doing this, you definitely will. You'll get taken to jail over this. You won't be released to mom or dad or stepdad, whoever it may be. So, I mean, if that's the road you want to go, then by all means, keep doing what you're doing. Um, but it's a very simple thing. All you have to do is listen to me and stop. And I would have brought you back, called mom, and released you to mom. But now you have three charges on you today. I don't know if you're trying to show off for the people outside, but it didn't quite work out in your favor. Do you have any questions or anything for me? Once your mom comes out, you're more than welcome to sit in the car with him. Once your mom comes out, I just have paperwork that you and your mom both need to sign, and then I'll get you on your way, okay? All right, over with him. After some time, it looked like the problem had been solved, but after leaving the scene, the woman began to behave aggressively again. What's going on? My mom, she's pissing me off. I'm just trying to go home, and I'm literally trying... She says she's going to take me to my dad's, but they took my bed and everything, so she needs to put that back, and I told her that she needs to put it back. That's literally all that happens, and she keeps yelling at me Mercedes, and what's, everything, what's bro. I mean, I'm not doing nothing. I'm literally not doing nothing. Have you been in trouble with JPL before? Yes, because they thought I hit my your mom, but she's the one that was hitting me, and I just pushed her off of me. They, did they take you to the detention center yet? No. Is that something you want to do? No, I'm just trying to go home, bro. I'm literally just trying to go home and go to I, sleep. I get that, man, but you're going to have to chill and relax for okay, a while, Okay, well, I will. You know what I mean? This is getting me mad, bro. I, I, I didn't even I get do it, nothing. But... Why is she yelling at me for? Are you going to talk? What? Are you going to let me talk? I'm listening to you. Mercedes, do you want to go to jail? No. Like, is that what you want? Who wants to go to jail? You want to go to like you want to. I don't. I just want to go home. I haven't slept. I haven't ate or nothing, bro. I'm freaking so mad. So here's the thing. I get, I get you're frustrated as, as hell right now. But the way you're acting, too. Okay, well, I'm sorry. What else do you have? Do you want me to ask? Are you going to be able to just way. relax and chill till you get home? You know okay, what I mean? I'm sorry. Bro, <laughs> well, we're trying to play volleyball and everything. <laughs> and they took me out of school. Will you guys take her over there? Or... 
to dad? Yeah. You want to go to dad's house? No, oh, it's f***ing hot over there. It's so hot. There's so many flies well, okay, in the steam. And I don't have my bed. Your, mom's, your mom went through all this trouble, came off of work today. Okay, well, that's not my fault. They should have just But listen to what I'm alone. saying. And then you're sitting here being disrespectful. It's okay, I'm hard. sorry. You keep saying you're sorry, but I can't leave you annoying if you're going to keep acting up like this. I'm not. Mercedes, do you understand that your actions are prolonging all of this? Yes, I okay. know. I'm so sorry. if you stop with your actions, You'll get home and get some food and get some sleep. But you keep acting like a child, we're going to continue to see us. We're going to prolong even longer, possibly go to jail. I mean, this is absolutely ridiculous at this point. And if you're truly sorry, the best apology is change. Just like the last case, meet the entitled 16-year-old who believed she was too young to go to jail. Because y'all be trying to take me to jail. I'm too young to go to jail. Shh, get that through your head. I don't want to go. On the 14th of September 2023, police officers responded to a call from a high school reporting an altercation between two students that had gone beyond what they could handle. When the officers arrived at the scene to properly understand the situation, they had to interrogate some school personnel who had witnessed the altercation. It was at that moment they began to have an idea of who they were going to be dealing with. So, what happened with that girl? Uh, we just finished. I was coming down the hill. I saw a group of students hanging out right up on the west side. Then I saw Mia and another student that were confrontational verbal. I let Lonnie know. I said, Lonnie, because he was busy with some other students. I said, hey, we got a situation. And Dr. was walking down. And I asked Dr. to have to go. And right in that moment, they both engaged. When I separate them, separate me and the other one, me I turn around and hit yeah. a couple on me. So they were both were, were yeah. yeah, they were both like, they, so. they were engaged. And I separated and then Lonnie came separate the other one. And I got me on the side yeah. and then me I just turned around. around. She turned around and hit you? Mm -hmm. They punched you? Mm -hmm. Where at? I just hit her on, but she just she, went. She hit you though. Yeah, and then yeah. I cut it out and then she got confrontation. And I then I, I restrained her. Did she got confrontation with you or the other person? With everybody. Did you have confrontation with, with, with everybody? With everybody. Okay. I had to restrain her again and again. she started kicking me right from the back. Yeah. Lenny had to restrain her, her leg because she was just out of control. She was just did a lot of profanity to everybody, told us off and said next time something's gonna happen and she just going down the line. Okay. Right after discussing with the school personnel, they proceeded to approach the student who would possibly turn out to be the most arrogant high schooler they ever met. Okay. All right, Mia. Or Alex, I'm sorry. Go ahead, stand up. You're making me anxiety. I'm going to be your freaking offices in here. We have to do, we're just working. No, I don't need you guys in here. You're making me get anxiety. Right after they met her, the cops knew that she was a spoiled brat who was used to ordering people around. And that meant that she was not going to treat them any different. I'm scared of y'all. I don't think you need y'all in here. Y'all making me get anxiety. And still, I don't care. I don't want y'all in here. Y'all making me anxiety. Y'all making me have anxiety. Y'all need to get that through your head. I'm getting anxiety from them. They're about to detain you. They're going to put your cuffs on you. For what? You can't, you're going to take me to jail. That's good. They can't. No, you're not. They have to. Yeah. No. They have to. No. Nope. They're not doing it because they want to. They actually have to. No, they don't. So, so Alex, let me, let me tell you what's going to happen, okay? No, you guys are not going to do that. Listen to me, okay? I'm, don't I'm, have I'm, the right. You're not have the right. I'm being completely honest. You're not have the right. I'll be straight up with you, okay? So we can, you can either be cool, calm, and collected, put the handcuffs on you, or we're gonna have to go hands off, which means we gotta do. Grab you, force, force you. you. Don't do yeah. We don't wanna do that. Those are your only no, options. No, Alex. We're not asking you. You have to. From her crazy behavior, it was obvious that she felt in control of the situation, and it somewhat interpreted the officer's niceness as something she could take advantage of, and she was determined to push it to the farthest it could go. Okay. So I'm, I'm gonna ask you one more time, okay? I'm not going with y'all, right? Have my mom take me to. and not freaking get do y'all. That's not how it works. Mom. Yes, y'all not taking me. I don't need to go with y'all. Can y'all stop being letting me go with y'all? I don't, don't want to go with y'all. I don't want to. No. What the f did I do? I didn't do shit. No, what did I do? What did I do? Stupid. That's not me. You should go. No, 
No, I'm not going to jail. You have to go with us. Y'all trying to take me to jail? No, I'm too young. I'm too young to go to jail. Y'all didn't understand. I'm not y'all's age. No, I'm not going to jail. No, just not. Y'all not detaining me. That's not what it is. No. It's 11 years old. Okay. I don't care. Y'all not detaining me. Y'all did not do that last year. And I don't give a fuck. You're not doing it to me. No. No, you did not do it to me yesterday. Or last year, you did not. You did not do it. I knew y'all yes last year, and I know y'all did not do it. Don't even lie. No, y'all did it. I knew it. No, y'all did it. No, y'all did it. If I knew, y'all would have been with them already. Not did it. I was with my mom. My mom. Got me. Alex, hey, just, just look at me real quick. Hey, I cannot breath. be with y'all. I know, take a breath. So. What? Oh my god. Take a breath. I'm, I'm trying to explain it to you, okay? And then you have to come with us. Who? Your your parents are going to get the police department. No, I don't want to go to the police. No. Alex, here. I don't want to go to the police. Okay. Well, okay. Out, okay? Oh my god. I don't want to go to the police. I'm not welcome there. That's not for me. It's, it's, it's gonna be with me and Corey. No. Else. Listen. I cannot go to the police. Yeah, Alex. Just get that through your head, please. While she continued being a brat, she was failing to realize that the cops were not going to remain nice to her forever. Just get that through your head. Shh. Get that through your head. I don't want to go. Alex. I don't want. I don't want to go. I understand that. Listen. Mm. Let, me, let, me, let me explain this real quick. If if you refuse and you try to fight with us. Well, can y'all just be, be quiet and just leave me alone? Yeah, well, stop trying to take me with y'all. I'm not trying to go. Yeah, doesn't it, doesn't it doesn't matter with y'all either. Do no, it doesn't matter. matter. No, it doesn't. Let me, let me say this so, so you'll understand. You refuse, I'm listen to y'all. You refuse to go with us. So we're going to have to charge you with another crime. Y'all cannot. That's not a crime. That's not a crime. Straight up. No, it's not a crime. It's not a crime. No, it ain't. 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 No, it ain't
It's hard to be bad. We will once we get to the place. Oh my god, you're making it worse or ow! No, we're not. We're yes, there's plenty own. more weight on her! No. Ow! Got it. No! Listen. Oh my god, bro. You're breath. making it stressed out. You're making me get sick. <laughs> I can't breathe. <laughs> I can't breathe. You're, you're, I can't breathe, bro. You're breathe. Do you have asthma? <laughs> yeah, yes. Oh, you're have, an inhaler. I don't have an inhaler. I don't have one. Okay. I don't even have one. I'm not... I don't have like. As soon as we get get you to the PD, <laughs> then we're gonna release you. Okay? And then you can go with mama. I can't breathe. Oh, I can't breathe. Here, yeah, hold, hold, hold the backpack. Is she getting the same thing as me? Oh, she, yeah, trust me, she's getting in trouble too. <laughs> oh. Take a breath, we got you. Alright? Not trying to hurt you. Not trying to do anything else. Realizing that there was nothing she could do about going to jail, rather than at least try to behave herself, she decided to unleash another level of craziness. Come here, please. Oh, Alex. Oh, Alex. No, leave me alone, please. Alex, please. Alex, please. Alex, no. Alex, you have to. No. I gotta check you. No, please. Alex, you just go check you. No, Alex. please. Alex. No. Alex, please. Alex. No. No, call my mom now. I don't need y'all. Please, call my mom. Alex. Check you first, girl. No! Hey. Stop! Alex, please stop. Ah! Alex, please stop. No, can y'all stop? Hey, we, we're trying to. Stop! We just need the key. Stop! Yeah, we just need the key. Stop! Okay. stop! Alex! Stop! Can you tell me to stop? Leave me alone! Listen, listen. Alex, stop! Listen. Stop touching me! Alex, Bye -bye. We have to check you, Alex. No! We have to. Ah! Stop! It's a bad one! Alex. Tell us what's in your pocket then. Put me down. What's in your pocket? Put me down. Put me down. We have to do. Put me down now. What's in your pocket? Where's Put me down. Tell me. Oh. Hey, Alex, look at me. Can I just talk to one of y'all, please? Listen. Let me walk. Take me off, please. Okay. Let me talk to one of the officers, okay. not you. Okay. Let me go. I got it. What, what's wrong? Oh. Hold on. We just want. I just. We need to make sure that you're not gonna hurt us or yourself. Oh, it's hurting me. Those aren't coming up. What's in your pocket? No. Tell me what's in your pocket that you don't want us to see. Just be real with us. If it's a, if it's like a vape, vape I don't care. Yes. Okay. You can't. I'm not gonna charge you with that. That's it. Yes. Okay. And we're gonna get it. Okay. See. That's all you have to do. But I need it because it makes me like not like anxiety or nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I feel you. Yeah. All right. We will release it to your guardian. Uh -huh. But I can't give it back to you, but I can give it back to them, okay? Yes. See, that's it. Okay. In the end, she was charged with two counts of battery upon school personnel and obstructing an officer. In this other case, things go a bit strange when a delusional teacher just couldn't accept that she got fired from her job. Oh, you up. Uh... Stop. Ah! Ah! On June the 6th, 2023 in Florida, officers were dispatched to a local brewery to address a disturbance at a school's end of year staff party where a woman who had recently been terminated from her job desired to confront her ex-boss, who happened to be at the staff party. Upon arrival, they found the lady intoxicated, along with two other ladies who were trying to prevent her from driving home due to her state. The officers went on to chat with the lady, but little did they know the situation would turn dramatic in a few minutes. That's her car. Okay. No, it's my boyfriend's well, car. Okay. Ma'am, what's your boyfriend's name? I'm not telling you. What is your boyfriend's name? Doesn't matter. We're trying to help you out, but okay. But I thought. Hey, well, you don't gotta throw your water. No, I have to. What's going on? Talk to me. Because I try to go in there and talk to a principal. What happened? Doesn't matter. Well, I mean, it matters to me. I'd like to know. He's an asshole. Oh, and I want to try and help you out a little bit here. 
I'm not driving. I know. But I'm just trying to have a conversation with you, that's all. Yeah. And now I'm gonna be the No, I didn't say that. Yeah. Okay. Not at all. The woman voiced her intentions, but the officers weren't ready to let that happen. And that's when the storm started brewing. Just let me drive home. Oh no, you're not gonna let you drive. Wait. He's on his way. Okay. We're just hanging out. Don't make me about. I'm not hey, the hey, person. Hey. hey, hey, that's not your car, remember? No, yeah, I'm not your car. Stop! It's not yours. Oh, it's alright. It's alright. Stop! But you go to jail, stop! You know I haven't done nothing wrong. But you can't hit on somebody else's car, that's not I don't yours. Care. She does it again, she goes to jail. Ma'am. Let's, let's not do that. Ma'am, hey, Mom. hey, look at me. Ma'am. Look at Mom. me. This is your last chance. Look at me. Mom. Hey, can you look at me real quick? I haven't got to talk to you yet. Okay. Can you look right here? Just focus on me. I've already talked to your boyfriend. He's going to pick you up and you get to go home and then just do whatever you want to do the rest of the day. Right? Yeah. So just listen to me. All so right. so I'm the calm. person can you just hear that me? gets. I hear you. Oh, I hear you, but please don't strike the vehicle anymore or Mom. I'm going to have to take you, okay? Mom. What are you threatening me? Come on. I don't know if you want. To Patricia, that. come on. All right, can we just relax, please? We're giving you a We're helping you out. Here. Come on. I'll f you up. He's uh, threatening a police officer. You want to go to jail, ma'am? No, to I want to f you up. So, ma'am, we were being very kind with you. We gave you a chance. We gave you a chance, and now you are going to go to jail. Right. All right. Right. So, we're going to get you up. We don't need any more charges, right? So right. please cooperate. Understood? Mom, I've let's stand up. I've to you so far. Let's stand nope. up. Mom. I'm not standing up. I'm not standing up. The situation escalated as the officers decided to arrest her, but little did they realize the woman was not willing to let it happen that easily. Take this on for you. Let her back off. Come on. Put your hands right here. Hey. Don't oh, f oh. me. Stop. Come on. Me. You're making this way stop. worse. Stop. Let, stop. Stop. Let go. Let go. Stop. 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 Let go, please. Stop. 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 Let go. Let go. Let go. Let me get your purse. Thank Let you. me hold your purse. Let go. Only. Let, Let go. go. I will give it to her. Let go. Let, Let go. go. Only. Okay, okay, okay. Let it go. Patricia, stop. Only oh, Miss Felicia. Okay, let it go. Okay. Let's let it go, baby. I'm right here. Good. Let it go. I got you. Yes. Oh. Stop. Stop. No. 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 Yeah. no. Why are you being this way? No. Yeah, why are you being this way? Nobody's messing with me. Stop. Me. Don't me. Don't me. Don't me. Don't me. I got smaller cuffs. I said don't me. I was Nobody's trying to. I said don't for me. You want to twist my arm? Nobody's twisting. We're just trying to get you back here. Okay? No. Go. Go. Stop. Ah. Ah. Let me go. Tensions rose further as the officers placed her in the police car, but she was not willing to be in a police car that day. The officer could not tolerate her entitled behavior.
Five men is on his way! Five men is on his way! Come! Go ahead! Watch your... Five men is on his way! Put your feet down. No! Yes, please. No! Five men is on his way! My man is on his way! Take the fuck out of you! Come here! Come here! Come here! In the end, she was taken to jail and faced charges of disorderly intoxication and resisting an officer.